properties of proportion now there are several properties of proportion and uh, by each of these properties there are certain rules which are there okay let's look at briefly on each one of them uh, by invertendo if a is to b is equal to c is to d then what we find is that b is to a is equal to d upon c so let's say if we write this a is to b as 5 upon 6 is equal to 10 upon 12 maybe right then what will be the value of b by a b is this a is this which is 6 upon 5 right is equal to c upon d d upon c so you just revert this 12 upon 10 now incidentally if you notice if i just divide both these numbers by 2 i get 5 upon 6 which is equal to the left side similarly if we divide this by 2 we get 6 upon 5 which is again equal to the left side so this property holds true again if a is to b is equal to c is to d then by alternando property a is to c is equal to b is to d let's see whether this is also true so let's say for example you have 5 upon 6 is equal to 7 upon 9 or actually 15 upon 18 right then by this property a is to c which is 5 by 15 is equal to 6 upon 18 incidentally again if you cancel these out you get 1 by 3 over here and 1 by 3 over here which means that this is also true then the third property is the componendo property which says that if a is to b is equal to c is to d then a plus b divided by b is equal to c plus d divided by d right let's say we take 3 upon 6 is equal to 4 upon 8 right this holds true then a plus b a plus b will be equal to 3 plus 6 or 9 a plus b 3 plus 6 divided by b which is 3 actually 6 is equal to c plus d which is 4 plus 8 or 12 divided by d which is 8 now if you notice this is 3 by 2 this is again 3 by 2 so componendo also holds true dividendo again the same thing if a is to b so let's again take 3 by 6 and 4 by 8 right a minus b is equal to 3 minus 6 upon 6 okay c minus d will be equal to 4 minus 8 upon 8 again 3 minus 6 upon 6 is minus 3 upon 6 which is minus 3 upon 6 is equal to minus 4 by 8 which is true because this is 1 by 2 this is also 1 by 2 and by combining these two properties of componendo and dividendo 3 and 4 what we say is if 3 upon 6 is equal to 4 upon 8 take this as a upon b is equal to c upon d then a plus b upon a minus b 3 plus 6 9 upon minus 3 a minus b should be equal to 4 plus 8 divided by c minus d which is minus 4 so 9 by 3 gives you 3 over here minus 3 is equal to 4 plus 8 gives you 12 divided by minus 4 gives you minus 3 so again this property holds so by using some of these properties you can solve several problems relating to proportion